Hey there, in this video we're going to talk about embarrassed embarrassed about the things that you're doing at a comedy hypnosis show. My name is Jeff Lewis and I help two people, eh, I help people, I'm not even going to edit anything out. You can tell my videos aren't it. I help people all over the world, literally all over the world, to entertainment for their events. And I am also a performer at some of those events. been doing stage hypnosis and comedy hypnosis since, well, 2007. It's been a long time. In these video questions about the comedy hypnosis shows and... The question I have asked, had asked was, will I embarrass myself if I volunteer at a comedy hypnotist? The answer to that is, not if the comedy hypnotist has any ethical morals whatsoever. Now, hypnosis does not make you act out of character. So you're not going to do anything against your moral code. And generally, you're not going to do anything completely out of character for yourself. That darn fly. I've done 10 videos today, and he's been in two of them. Anyway, I'm trying to kill him. So... It's not going to make you act out of character, and if the stage hypnotist gives you an instruction that would be against your moral code or you wouldn't find socially acceptable, generally you're not going to do it, okay? It's just not going to happen. Uh, that being said, someone like me, a professional, is not going to give you suggestions of anything that could be morally questionable to begin with, uh, or... A better way of putting it is I'm not going to give you suggestions that's going to embarrass you. Simple as that. That's not what my show is about. If my show was about that, I wouldn't get booked again and again and again for corporations and schools and fairs and festivals because, well, if I was embarrassing all of my volunteers, then I wouldn't be able to come back and perform again and again because they wouldn't want me there. There'd be complaints and all that stuff. So generally, if you trust the hypnotist, Number one, they're not going to make you do anything that's against your moral code, so you don't have to worry about being embarrassed there. And number two, if they have any ethics at all, they've designed their show about making you empowered uh, more than really embarrassing you in any way, shape, or form. I hope this has helped, and I want to thank you for watching the video. If you need entertainment or if you're looking to book a comedy hypnosis show, hypnotistjessielewis.com, I'd be glad to help. Uh, if I can't help you out, I do work with over 1,500 other entertainers that I guarantee fit for your event. Simple as that. So fill it, and I'll be glad to help you out. You'll either be dealing with me directly or Princess, my virtual assistant, to help you find that entertainment that you need. Thanks so much, and I'll see you in the next video where we are about what do you do if a volunteer doesn't get hypnotized? Okay? I'll see you in the next video, and I'll answer you that question, and I'll talk to you then. Bye. Jesse Lewis from Hypnotist Jesse Lewis.